Hi, I'm Abel, and I'm a senior guide here at the Teaching Drum Outdoor School for the Wilderness Guide program. And today, I want to talk about our solo canoes uh, that we use here in our programs. So you'll see this on the equipment list. This is not an item to buy. This is an item we carry here at the school. And so we provide these. We charge a $250 deposit that we return after you're done using the canoe. Okay, so uh, that, that deposit includes a, a paddle and a life vest. All right, so the canoe. This is our Wee Lassie uh, solo canoe. And uh, you can look up Wee Lassie on Google and find out all kinds of information and historical information about where it came from and who designed it. But basically, this is a copy of the boat that the fur traders and the first contact people uh, saw the natives in the area using. Right away, when they started using these boats, they realized the value of the design. And so it's carried through to today, and it's known as the Wee Lassie. It's uh, very small, it's only 10 and a half feet long by 28 inches wide at its widest spot. They're lightweight. This one here weighs about 25 pounds and it's made from fiberglass and wood for the gunnels. They uh, are made in uh, other materials. You could find them in uh, Kevlar and even carbon fiber. So uh, I've seen the carbon fiber ones weigh in at 12 pounds, super light. And the Kevlar ones weigh around 17 pounds. So you could look, you could search and find these if uh, you so desire to, to get one for yourself. This boat, uh, this is my personal boat, and it was made in the 1970s. And so it's almost 50 years old now. <clears throat> Love it. Awesome boat. We don't use kayaks here. Kayaks are not very functional because they have a covered top and covered back, and you're getting slipping inside that. That's really great for uh, open waters where you have big waves and uh, potential of waves coming into the, or water coming into the boat. But with our waterways here in the North Woods, we have relatively small lakes, medium to small lakes, and a lot of streams, shallow streams, windy, shallow streams. In fact, we have 720 lakes just in our local area here and countless streams and waterways that you can uh, explore in a boat like this. Uh, another nice thing about a canoe, uh, having an open area, it allows you to pack gear. So you can pack all your gear in this boat very easily. These canoes actually can carry about 350 pounds of weight, loaded weight. So that gives you uh, a lot of flexibility about yourself plus all your gear that you want to take out camping. Um, they're very easy to use. We, um, uh, when we get in them, when we use them, you sit down on the bottom of the canoe like this. So you're down <clears throat> close to the water. The water is right here. So your, your butt is actually right below the water line. Uh, and so this uh, gives you a nice low profile on the water. And this allows you uh, very good stealth quality. So if I want to, you know, let's say I'm going up a creek and I see the deer coming down, walking on the edge, you know, I have a very low uh, profile, and if I just hold still, they, they don't see you. And you can get quite close to deer this way. And that was uh, a lot of the ways how hunting was done in the, uh, in the old times. Very maneuverable. It, uh, you're down in the water. It's really easy to turn the boat and guide it through. And it's actually quite stable because your, your center of gravity is low in the boat and down below the water line. You're not sitting up high in the boat. It does require, though, that you could be able to sit cross-legged and have a strong back so that you're used to sitting that way. Um, you can stretch your legs out. On long trips, I, I stretch my legs out like this. In a boat like this, you know, learning how to sit cross-legged and feeling comfortable in that position is uh, needed. So that is the Wee Lassie Canoe. Uh, we got lots of videos of us using these, and you'll see them. Uh, we'll show you a lot of different ways how they're used, and just a, a lot of fun. Really opens up your um, opens up the wilderness in this area to explore. Uh, you can go on long camping trips, and uh, just a lot of fun. 
So the Wee Lassie Canoe here at the Teaching Drum Outdoor School.